Cleanup and recovery efforts press on in Texas after Hurricane Barrel made landfall along the Gulf Coast yesterday as a Category 1 hurricane. But local officials are warning residents that recovery will take time. Fox Weather's Katie Byrne has more from Galveston. The storm has come and gone, and now millions of Texans are picking up the pieces following a direct hit from Hurricane Barrel. It made landfall along the Gulf Coast early Monday as a Category 1 storm, bringing high wind and heavy rain. And while anxious residents assess the damage, power crews are out in big numbers, hoping to restore service to millions of customers. The local officials say it won't be easy. This will be a multi-day restoration effort. This was a big storm that has affected a lot of customers. So I'd ask Texans for their patience as the crews are out there doing their best. A big issue now, the dangerous heat wave baking much of the country. Here in Galveston, the heat index hit 104 degrees on Tuesday. And cooling centers like this one are now open throughout the area, giving people a chance to beat the heat and charge their devices. When you lose power, it's hard to cook for yourself. It's hard to do your laundry. They may have trees on top of their house. They may have a flooded home. There's a lot of things that they're juggling and try to figure out. A heat advisory is now in place for Southeast Texas, but that's not stopping folks from repairing their homes and businesses. It's still not clear how many structures were damaged or destroyed, but most Texans say they plan to rebuild as soon as possible and help their neighbors do the same. As soon as this is cleared up, we're going to make our way around because other neighbors have damage. Barrel is now weakening as it moves north, but there's still a chance of flooding in some parts of the Midwest. In Galveston, Texas, Katie Byrne, Fox Weather.